Hello, I'm Josie Couture. Welcome to Josie Couture Real Estate TV, your Toronto real estate home and garden channel. If you're planning a move to Toronto or already live here, but you're not sure what type of accommodation you'd like to buy, this month's video is for you. Your preferred choice of lifestyle and your budget will dictate what type of house you may want to consider buying in Toronto. This month, we're going to discuss the types of houses that you can find in Toronto. So come on, let me show you what we can find. Houses. In Toronto, the most common type of houses are detached, semi-detached and row houses. These three types of houses can be found with either three, two and a half, two, one and a half, and sometimes only one single story. They tend to be older houses, circa 1900s, and many Toronto neighborhoods feature this type of house. Freehold townhouses. These are usually two, three, or sometimes four levels high. They are typically attached on both sides, sometimes semi-detached. They are usually newer than houses, but sometimes they are new or under construction. There are no maintenance fees attached to a freehold townhouse where you own the land just like a house. Laneway houses. A fast-growing trend in Toronto, laneway houses are converted garages or purpose-built smaller houses sitting behind a principal house on laneway. Toronto has a vast number of laneways and many houses with garages are perfect for conversion. For more on laneways and laneway houses, we did a whole video about the topic. Split levels. These can have the exterior appearance of a bungalow, but they are typically slightly higher with multi-levels. Some are side splits and some are back splits. Link houses. These houses are typically newer and located just on the outskirts of Toronto. They have the appearance of a detached house, but they are in fact attached or linked from the basement. There's no doubt that the location, the size and the condition of the house affects pricing despite the type of property. This is why it's important that you select a trustworthy and experienced realtor to help you through the process of choosing the right type of property for you and your family. For more information about this topic, Toronto real estate or neighborhoods, or to buy or sell a house, I'm just a click or a call away. I hope that you enjoyed this month's video. To follow along with me, please click subscribe at the end of this video. And if you like this video, please click like and share. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you next month.